Not guilty. That is the jury's verdict after 10 hours of deliberation over the course of two days in the double murder trial of Luis Antonio Arroyo. It is a verdict that brought Arroyo to tears. Paul Venema from the Justice Center with reaction to that verdict. This defendant. Tears from Luis Arroyo in the verdict, not guilty, on two counts of murder, was read. He was accused of killing his neighbors, Keitha Jackson and Rodney Spring, in the winter of 2016 during an argument over a package of cigarettes. During closing arguments, the defense told the jury that the state's witness testimony was void of credibility. We always felt that uh, the state's evidence was not enough to convince a jury beyond a reasonable doubt. But enough, he conceded, to have Arroyo's first trial last summer end in a mistrial after the jury could not reach a verdict following two days of deliberations, and lengthy deliberations this time. It was a hard fight. Uh, sometimes the facts don't favor the state, sometimes they don't favor the defense, and you just run with what you can. While awaiting trial last spring, Arroyo escaped from the Bear County Jail. He was captured within hours. Following the mistrial, he was tried on the escape charges, convicted, and sentenced to 99 years in prison. Before dismissing the jury, the judge explained to them that in spite of their verdict, Arroyo was not a free man. He still must serve that 99-year sentence on the escape conviction. Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.